All right, welcome back. It's now time to catch you up on all the happenings in the crazy world of Survivor. Survivor! Yes, yeah, so much good stuff in this episode. Okay, so first off, really briefly, back at camps after the last tribal, Noel comes back and she's like really thankful to the guys for saving her because she's on the bottom of the numbers. Yes, she was. They sent NECA instead, which was great. Mm -hmm. But also, Gabler is really annoying his tribe. He's on the yellow, and he put that like palm frond thing on the people. I would have been ticked, by the way, if I was the one sleeping and someone put that over me. I'd be like, what is happening? It was just right a little weird. It was very weird yeah. but the reward challenge okay so first of all look at this setup it was a really first of all it was fun and it wasn't a puzzle which was nice to see because <laughs> yeah. we haven't seen a lot of not puzzles too this many season. puzzles in this, in this yeah. show i think but. yeah so they essentially took like the i don't know like whatever they call the little bag things and They're threw them and had to get it, them off yeah them and yeah. then there was another kind of like tossy thing at the end but what's interesting about this reward challenge is what the reward was so the winning tribe got 10 huge like fish mm -hmm. and they got to go to a different camp like one of the other tribes camps and take one of whatever they wanted, right? Yeah. Now here's what's interesting, okay? So the red tribe ends up winning the reward challenge, but and they did not have flint. They don't have a way to cook their yes. fish. Yes, so, so they kind of barter with Jeff. They're yeah. like, hey, what if we gave you the fish back or whatever? And I'm like, can you do that? Can you barter yeah. with Jeff? Like, I, I didn't know was he was odd. in the bartering business. You no, know? me either, and I didn't know you could just like tr trade your reward like that. But honestly, smart on them, like good <laughs> call on their part, because then they got a basket of fruit. So. Um, now, what's interesting, okay, so I mentioned they get to go to a different uh -huh. um, a different tribe, uh, whatever, camp. Yes, so Cody goes mm -hmm. to the blue camp, right, which is also funny because the blue uh, tribe's been untouched this whole time. That's right. They're so, the strongest so far. Yeah, but his bartering was really interesting. So tell me a little bit about it. Well, so, like, his tribe didn't agree with him uh, that he wanted the machete, yeah. but he still went in asking for the machete. Yes. But then they didn't want to give him that, so then he was like, well, I won't take that if you will give me fishing equipment and what, a little yeah. bit of food. Or yeah, basically like that. more in return. So it's like really it was kind of smart on him yeah. to figure that out because I think they're I think they're better off with the fishing gear. Uh, yeah, I, I agree. Okay, so then we get to the immunity challenge and Here's what's funny, all right? So it was like kind of like a puzzle challenge, but this one was like a little different than what we've seen, right? So yeah. the red tribe uh, wins first like they get it done first, right? Mm -hmm. Here's what just absolutely blew my mind is that they helped the yellow tribe win, uh -huh. which is hilarious for two reasons, yeah. right? One, because Red just took all their stuff off their tribe. Now they're helping them <laughs> lose the immunity challenge, which is just so Playing funny to dirty. me. pretty dirty. Yeah, robbing them twice in one week. But like, I understand <laughs> that those two tribes have been to council. They want to help, like make the blue team a little yeah. bit weaker because they had not been. So my question absolutely. is, are they going to still be in cahoots as we go forward? I don't or know. Or that just for this one little Yeah, time? I don't know. I don't know. I, I, Blue was upset about it. Yes, it will be interesting, and that's what I love about when we get to the merge part of the season uh -huh. two is it's interesting to see who like collaborates and starts working together and aligning because you never really know, right? Yeah, is this foreshadowing yes. how that's gonna go? Yeah, I don't know. So as we said, Blue um, ends up losing the immunity challenge. So post immunity challenge back at the Blue camp, it's funny we see two players really stick out. So Geo who's, I don't know, he's been at the forefront a little bit, but he's like really on this big power trip for no yeah. good reason. The man has right. no power, right? No. Mm -mm. And then Lindsay. Who's been playing a fine game until this Pretty point. under the radar, well yeah. aligned, all yeah. of a sudden becomes Miss Paranoia. Which was really annoying, and I think really put her in the on the chopping block. Yes, absolutely. Just for that reason alone. Yeah, absolutely. And it's funny because like then... When you're paranoid, okay, <laughs> on this game, I think like you lose your power in a weird way. Like I think your power is put in other people's hands. You become very, yeah, just very open yeah. to anything. Yeah, because then you become very or... disposable, you know, because it's like if you're yeah. paranoid now and we're only in week four or whatever it is, like what are you gonna be like when we get to the merge oh, and we're trying to trust each other, you yeah. know? This is so, where you're not strong. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so it was interesting to see that play out. So we get to yeah. tribal and there's, you know, just more conversation about this general paranoia. Lindsay really like touches on that. Um, it was a, I don't know, it was fun to see them go to tribal for the first time. Mm -hmm. um, ultimately, Lindsay goes. Mm -hmm. And here's my thing. It just frustrates me when stuff like this happens because like she was the demise of her own game. You know right, what I mean? Right. Like she would have been fine. Carla and James had her back had she not been paranoid, mm -hmm. but because she was so in her head, They're she like, literally went yeah, out. We're yeah, we're just gonna get And she could have made it far. I mean, who knows? She, she could have been a final tribal, you know? Who knows? So yeah. at the end of this at the very end, she said she played a hard game and she thinks that that's what got her kicked off. I'm like, yeah. oh, that's not what got yeah, her kicked off. Yeah, I'm like, you were in your head. You were on your own worst yeah, enemy. Good so life lesson. Yes. But <laughs> this season really is getting exciting. I I I'm I mentioned last week, it was kind of a slow start for me, but yeah. I think it's getting better and better each episode. I'm excited to see what happens tonight. I'm really kind of hoping for a double elimination. Yeah, I would like to see some more people go and some more action. Halfway. Yes. 
Yeah, so, so of course they can catch a brand new episode tonight right here on CBS or stream it tomorrow on Paramount+. Right. Plus.